Hello and welcome back to Europa Universalis 3, where we're about to be called into a war by Urbino. Already checked who they're at war with, with Naples and Holland. Oh, Naples is actually pretty close, so I already started dispatching my fleet and Marine Corps in order to hopefully get there before they, you know, f finish the siege. Naples was more powerful in the past, but they have fallen quite a bit in recent years. Anyway, I'll get this more often now that people will call me will call on me to defend them when they're attacked by someone. Also, the Hansa is being attacked by France, however, they did not ask for our help. So, so. But I'm gonna honor the call from Ubino and try to defend them. The other part of the the other part of the uh ally, of the alliance against them is Holland, so we're just gonna go to Holland. Tell them that it's not that it's not okay to attack to attack another HRE member, you know? Oh well that's in the driver's seat at least. Uh thank you. There, it's gonna take a while, but I think I can't to me. I do have access to a lot of Well actually let's first let's just Except also ally with Portugal. Emperors rush to the defense of Rubino against foreign aggression. Of course. And we've also taken a leadership role, that's good. Now since we're at the war we should also be able to send troops through. Because they're also part of the Holy Roman Empire, most of these states here. Yeah. And they see, you know, I'm trying to defend one of ours, so might as well let my people walk through. Okay, go ahead, continue. Please assign up their military alliance with Holland. That's that's a bad choice. Also, Oldenburg. What the hell's going on with Oldenburg? Huh? Thieves. Catholic Oldenburg? Well, we're about to change that. Naples refuses. Well, Naples can refuse as much as they want. Uh, I do need to continue building stuff, though. Start doing that real quick. Portugal in that war? They're not. Okay. We we'll have to deal with the people that I said, and also Oldenburg and Cleves. I'll just split it in half. Where'd the army go? They had an army at one point. I don't see it anywhere. There's a Holland army over there. We maybe want to we maybe deal with that. Earliest possible, at the earliest possible, um, you know, chance. Naples is already laying siege to that. Since we're there, we can probably also liberate Munster. I'll get some further bonus points for liberating another currently non-existing uh, entity.
only to siege the same province. Well. Tell me that went... That, that took the mountain passes arrives almost at the same time. <laughs> huh? Well, apparently we already did that. Now we can go on and search thing. That up too. Someone maybe take care of the Oldenburg army over there. Book, thank you. All right, how's it looking? Badly, to be honest. I have a fleet here at Napoli. I think one at some point. This is already over. The rest is being sieged. Filipino controls the province now. If you have a claim on this, you could just take it, you know? Don't, well. Probably not gonna do that, but. One. They might have colonies somewhere, like they apparently have a colony way over there. Are they part of the Holy Roman Empire, by the way? No, apparently they're not. Of course. Outside aggressors. is done. What do I want to help out next? Get around. All right, I need to spend a few more magistrates. Selling colonists to Buru, which is a small island way over here. Since we have a core now at um, at the Ceylon Island, probably just Ceylon, uh, we can actually colonize the so far pretty much uncolonized, you know, Australia and Oce Oceania region. Bunga was being blocked again. Uh, I didn't get ten ships over here. Might be dangerous now with war and all. Just Naples and Holland though. So good. Yeah, was that fleet here? And that over. You know.
All the Hanzo ones and all. <sighs> against against whom? Against all of them? Oh, against France and having military access and royal marriage and all that. Sorry, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm not sure how you got into that particular situation. But uh, there's not much I can do here. First, fail to defend the Hansa against foreign aggression. Well, wouldn't I say? have asked earlier, you know, before we started this whole other war and not sure how they how, how they got how they got into that in the first place. So, since Leaves is already defeated, Vassal of Holland, I see. Well, Alright, so we're quite a few troops over there, so I don't think I need to send anything else, so it might be quicker with the guns and all. Yeah, apparently they're still at 0%, so choice going there. As long but also Vassal. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna release them. We're gonna release them. We have some spare points, force them to convert. Well, they are already partisan. So we don't have to do, do that, but uh, they can release, you know, Winstar. Get here. Oh. Yeah. March back. So we're only missing Utrecht. Well, I do probably have to deal with France at some point, but I didn't, you know, want to do it right now. Could first deal with our own internal struggles. I see that correctly, Ferrara doesn't exist anymore, so we can ask them to group. Kindly release it. 
Check these guns. Them now. So we're gonna have to speed them up. Release those vassals though. Speaking of releasing, release a moonstone. Gallery. All right, we're still there. Of treaties. Stop that too. A steel. All right. I'm fine with that. I'm probably not gonna let more happen. That's pretty decent. Oh, Munster has risen from the ashes. Galra did not count? Why did Galra not count? What if we bought 40? So apparently Galra counted too, it just didn't get a didn't get a you know pop up. Anyway. Over from Oldenburg. Oh, they're being released as Vassals now, so we can make peace with them separately. I see. Gonna revoke a few cores. More vassal, so we don't do anything stupid in the future. Holland. All right. So you're also gonna be forced vassal also gonna be forcibly vassalized. Legion. Alright. Let's convert it to true faith, yeah. Naples renounce the claim on Akona, Rufino, alright. Take that back though. Get any serious headway. Let's create a new unit. Let's. Quarters. Two. And more infantry. Guys march over there. Into the treasury. Not that the treasury partic particularly needs that, but you know. So apparently, France released Bremen. Wasn't a particularly negative outcome. Strange enough, the provinces of Bremen and Holstein are kind of you know messed up now because Bremen should have this this uh, this province and. Um, Holstein the other one, but, you know... <laughs> I don't think I can mediate, you know, any changes, you know? It would be fun. Alright, sorry Hansa that we didn't get to help you there, but you know, if you asked earlier, I would have tried, but not when we were already, you know, deployed for fighting in another, another war. That's just, you know, bad timing. Which evokes more the feeling of like, oh, I'm way in over my head, let's quickly ask the Emperor to, you know, cancel all the plans and help me out instead. And I have other plans, maybe? Um. 
Spend more influence. Are you already under the influence? Your hand if you're not on the Is there an influence map maybe? Influence. Okay. Well that was helpful. Turn my influence. Humble, I guess. Denmark has to deal with a Norwegian uprising. I might not be able to get their forces there because I kind of, you know, because there's some Swedish territory there and they're not on the best, you know, relations. Oh well. Spend mm, some more money for my dear um, well, objects, probably. Be the, would be the proper connotation. Um, where we need some, need some gifts. I would like to increase my relations with everyone, so since I have, you know, um, enough imperial authority now, I might try and just enact these reforms, which do interesting things because it gives that this one gives me a huge tax modifier while everyone else loses a little bit. And as I said, it would be really funny if we just solved the whole German uh, unification thing by just um, <laughs> by just doing that. <sighs> we'll see. Still war with Mali, I guess. To help you there if you ask again, but kind of didn't. Take another look at the religion map. This it seems like Protestantism is, you know, slowly taking over Germany. <laughs> Not sure who's responsible for all that. Must be some religious nuts, you know? Meanwhile, I was still have that weird assignment to build a larger fleet than Castile. Apparently they have built up their fleet further, but we're not that far away anymore. Or over the, we are over the support limit, but it just increases our, you know, our maintenance costs and with the kind of money that we have just lying around in our treasury, I think I could just, you know, say whatever. So let's say whatever and put some more. Oops, someone wanted to marry into my family and I kind of missed it. Thought it was another peace offer, so I just spaced out there. I said, let's hold your horses, Napoli. Uh, Naples, I mean. We'll get to you in a sec. Finish that siege in Napoli, maybe?
considering we're, we're, you know, heretics, we don't have the worst relations with the Papal State, to be honest. Not that we, you know, gain anything particular out of that, but... Also doesn't belong to the Holy Roman Empire somehow. So, I'm gonna get a few more gifts. Let's just be. Let's just have bygones be good bygones. What the hell? Eden, what are you doing again? You wanna go for another Indian invasion? Don't you see that I'm still, you know, busy fighting in a war and all that? They're not gonna contribute to that at all, you know? Just, just, just saying right now. But it's probably worth keeping them around as allies, you know, in case we have to deal with France one day. So we're gonna go on a, go to India again. Yay! Finally. Alright, got a couple of transporters. Okay, uh, tribute. So, you are going to. Actually, don't have anything to release. What? There's a core on Ferrara here. Does Ferrara still exist? Though? I don't see it anywhere around here. So I thought it wouldn't. Possible that they have, you know, colonies somewhere that just continues to exist, but apparently I can't release anyone. That's a shame, really. care whom you have trees with to be honest let's answer the one with Mali uh, no Ottomans Tripoli Could also get the province here, not sure what I'm gonna do with it, but I could get it. But if I could get it and just, you know, release it as a vassal again, that would be optimal, but apparently... Apparently there was guys still somewhere. That's weird. Ara. Ara. Also can't look for them and, you know, finding a province. I don't know. Why would they have colonies, though? Vienna ship. I'll get them to see that province because that province is, you know, should be part of the part of the Holy Roman Empire. It's not, so I should think I should get it back. Might be that I have to, you know, station some troops here, or maybe I can sell it to someone. 
that might also be a sync possibility that I'll just go here and then just sell it to someone like the Papal State or Siena. Literally anyone around here. Because while it's probably a pretty province and all, huge production. Well, anyway, we're gonna get that. Get that. Awesome treaties. Empire has triumphed against the vicious aggressors of Naples, yeah. Very vicious aggressors they were indeed. That is also right now I'm at war. Anyway, I'll try to release them. Also I will try to find out where, you know, Ferrara went off to. Well, in any event, I'm gonna wrap up this episode right here. And the next one will probably be caught to war by one of our, you know, Imperial subjects and all. Who do still like us. So, uh, that's, that, that's good, right? Cologne could also vote for us, but they don't like us much. But we can change that. <laughs> we can definitely change that. Don't worry. Anyway, uh, we'll see more next time. Have a good one.